Alright guys, it's about 4.30 in the morning. It is the third day of the Colombian trip and it's been a pretty tough trip so far. But today we are leaving to go on a one hour boat ride and we have a one hour hike to get back to some hidden lagoon in the depths of Colombia that apparently has a lot of big fish in it. And putting all I can into this one day. It's going to be a hard walk. Going to the middle of the jungle, it's going to be humid. It's going to be hot. There's going to be a lot of snakes. Who knows what we'll come across, but when we get there, that's where the giants live, apparently. Just incredibly secluded, almost virgin waters. We're going to see how big a fish are in there. We're going to start this day. Thank you guys for watching. Crazy bird. Bird, you won't leave us alone. Dude, he's like a dog. <laughs> oh my gosh. Half hour later, the bird is still with us. Go! <laughs> we finally made it. <laughs> it's been what? Two and a half hours since we left camp? Something like that. It's been a while. We're about to get on block. some big fish. Worth the wait? I hope so. <laughs> Listo, Herman? Listo. We got some rocks up here. We're gonna see what's going on with this. Let's see? Come on, don't they die? Let's see if there's one hiding in that corner. If they were largemouth, that's where they would be. Maybe one on this corner. There he is, yes! Oh! Grande, grande, grande. Yes! Oh, jeez, I can't slow him down. He's towing this thing. He's not that big. Very powerful. So beautiful. Listo. Gracias. Almost had it with these. How come I catch them and you don't?
Oh, look at him. Look, that was insane. That was crazy. Did you see that? Did you see that? I was burning it back to make that other cast and this big male just destroys me. Oh. Look at that hump on his head. <laughs> wow, he's got a giant bump. That means he's a, a boy? A male. Yeah. That bump does, huh? Very strong. What, do they fight with it or something? Bad boy. Do they fight with that? No. It's in the reproduction. So does it only come up when they're spawning? Mm -hmm. Other times of the year it's not there? It's not there. Sometimes not. Oh, I see. Awesome. Let's let him go. Yeah. That was the fastest hit yeah. I've had. Did you see it? Yeah. It was just making a beeline for me. Oh! I missed it. Come try again. Head shakes are insane. Got him. Yes. <sighs> Three for three. Come on. You got it. You got my third fish. Oh, nice one. Got it. Yes. <laughs> Jerry, you hooked? No. <laughs> oh. Probably a ten pounder. <laughs> Be careful if you go all that. Great oh, fight on that fish. Nice fish. Wow. Okay. Adios. Adios. Okay, Ty. Nice. Do that again. There we go. Yeah. And the bird appears within five seconds. <laughs> Look at him. He's crazy. <laughs> Whoa, hey, give me that. 
All right, guys. Thank you for watching. You're still watching. No one means the world to me. I'm feeling pretty high on life right now. Just got back from fishing and got a truck of a pond catfish. Super excited about that. Stay tuned for that. That's coming up and I'm just giddy with excitement about it. Um, the reel I was using in this video, Casting Sharky Gold 3, I'm sure you could hear the drag just screaming off of that reel, but that was an incredible reel and if it did that well on the Amazon, I think it's going to be a pretty good reel in the States as well. But I hope you guys enjoy the peacock bass fishing footage. That stuff is so much fun and I'm sure you can tell those fish just hit with a ton of force, a ton of speed and sometimes you can't even really set the hook because they just hit and they run instantly. Just so much fun catching them. Uh, making this video got me super excited about an upcoming trip to Guyana where I'll be catching a ton of peacock bass and also a lot of huge Amazon monsters like Arapaima and Piraiba. Coming up in October, for now, thank you guys for watching. Please subscribe. Get me closer to 100,000. Really appreciate all the support. Thank you guys.